Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews. And today I've got another episode of What's New. And if you were in my live stream the other day, I told you that I was looking for the new Oreo cookies that they have out there. And guess what? <laughs> I found them. So these are new from Oreo. And this is one of two flavors. I'm going to try one now and I'm going to try another one later. So the first one is from the Visco Oreo. These are the dark chocolate cream flavor. It says it's new. <laughs> and like I said, I have not found these before. Oh, oh yeah, I've tried. <laughs> Interestingly enough, on the back it says you've got to try these Oreo bars. I have tried them, actually pretty good. And so on this one, the calorie content for two cookies is 140, so it's 70 cookies per, 70 calories per cookie. And here on the back it says, at Oreo we love cocoa, so we use real cocoa in every chocolatey Oreo cookie we make. And for news, go to oreo.com chocolate candy. You can look up candy stuff. And so that's what you get when you try the chocolate Oreos with all the information on the front. And here we go. <laughs> you know, I just noticed this on the label the other day. <laughs> it's kind of funny because it says right underneath the content. I don't know if you could read this right here. I'm going to give you a real close up. It says... <laughs> Slit appears when opened. <laughs> uh, don't know who did that one or why they put that information that you would want to <laughs> know that <laughs> for future reference. Doesn't sound really friendly. So here we go. Opening it up. And I guess that's the, <laughs> the slit that appears <laughs> when you open it. <laughs> Mm, oh yeah, that smells really good. And here we go. Here's the Oreo cookie that we all know and love. And in the middle, it's got the dark chocolate cream. And I'm assuming the cookie is going to be the same as the regular Oreo cookies. It's not a chocolate cookie. It's just dark chocolate cream. So twist that open. Get a good look at it inside. It's very, very dark. And I'm going to go ahead and try the cookie by itself, just because I know that's what the cookie is. So. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice crispy cookie. Um, there's a dark chocolate cream. And if you're like me, you like to twist it off and then Sometimes you just like to eat the cream out of the middle. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and eat the cream by itself. Hmm. Ooh. Wow. Ooh. Mm. Dark chocolate. Nice and creamy. Cream? Mm. Man, oh, that's good. Mm. That's a... <laughs> Ooh. Dark chocolate, that's where it's at. I'm, a, I'm Personally, I'm a dark chocolate fan, so I like it. And so now I'm just going to go ahead, get a cookie by itself, not without tearing it apart. I'm going to try the cookie just on its own. Hmm. As you can see, pretty good amount of cream in the middle. Nice creamy chocolatey flavor to it. Mmm, that's really good. I think I kind of prefer the dark chocolate cream to the regular vanilla cream. So it's not too bad. So now that I've <laughs> tasted the cookie, the cream, and the cookie all together, what better way than to try it with a little bit of milk? So 
I'm going to do like everybody else does, and I'm going to dip the cookie in the milk and see what that tastes like. <laughs> and maybe I'll give a little bit of chocolate milk. So here we go. Got that softened up. And here we go. Taste it with the milk. Mmm. Mmm. Ooh. Mmm. It is good with the milk. It brings out the chocolatiness, the chocolatiness of the cookie when you dip it in the milk. So, yeah. Hmm. Mm hmm. It's a very good cookie. If you're a fan of dark chocolate, Hmm. Yeah. I would go ahead and give this a try. And apparently from what I've heard, this is a permanent flavor. It's not a limited edition. It's not a seasonal thing. This is a dark chocolate. It's going to be regular on their cookie lineup, I guess. So... If you're a fan of the dark chocolate, go ahead and check them out. I'll go ahead and give you my rating on it for the dark chocolate Oreos. Mm. You know, I'm just going to go ahead and rate it for the cookie and the milk and the whole thing, the whole shebang. I'll give that one 10 out of 11. It's a good cookie. It is it is Oreo. The cookie itself is nothing new. So it's the cream and the dark chocolate that made it really good. I think if you know, even dipping it in the milk, it just kind of it kind of stayed the same. It didn't really kick it up anymore. I think what I would like if I was the Oreo designer is the chocolate cream in the middle, but somehow make the cookie on the outside not just that kind of that same oreo flavored chocolate cookie but like a a deeper darker chocolate to the cookie itself and that to me would have made it you know a 11 out of 10 or even if not another thing that might be good oreo people if you're listening try this <laughs> fudge covered dark chocolate oreo cookies that would be good. It'd be triple chocolate Oreo. You'd have your cookies that are the chocolate, the chocolate cream, and the chocolate fudge on the outside. That would be, to me, that would be an 11 out of 11. So Oreo people, if you're listening, give it a try. Never know. Might catch on. So that's my take on the dark chocolate flavored cream Oreos. And... They're at most of the grocery stores pretty much now. They've made it out there, so if you can find them, go ahead and pick you up a bag and check them out. See if you like them. If you don't like the dark chocolate, go with the regular Oreos or one of the many other flavors that they have out there, including some of the other flavors that I'm going to be trying in a, in a future review. So, till next time on Drew's Food Reviews, I'll talk to you later, and... Um, <laughs> Don't steal my cookies because they're all for me. And as you know, I like cookies. So, till next time on Drew's Food Reviews, I'll talk to you later.